so many people from the private equity industry and bankers uh, and who also really prove to be the hub of business in this industry nowadays. I think um, there were two big purposes to this event. One was probably sharing the information on the current situation and then obviously the second part of it is networking. You know, there is a certain suggestion at Q3 volume trends that there is a certain level of proportion that you might creeping into the region. That, that, that finally the, the big guys of private equity world have set their the targets big enough to, to, to get interested in the region. We, uh, we were provided with some market data by Merger Market which give us statistics on deals and transactions happening. Um, but we were interested in which things make deal, deals possible succeed in the future. What uh, is now the big question is what's the outlook, what it's going to be like, whether it's going to be a double dip, whether it's going to be just a slow slowdown. I, I think in, in general it's a good uh, moment to update, uh, to get an update on the situation on the market. But when it comes to policy, uh, I think it's worth mentioning two things. What is this policy, uh, particularly as it relates to privatization, and practical effects of this policy and I will leave the judgment up to you whether indeed a continuation of this approach is warranted.